Seussisms, a guide to life for those just starting out and those already on their way, by Dr. Seuss, narrated by me. Be true to yourself. You have brains in your head, you have feet in your shoes. You can steer yourself any direction you choose. You're on your own, and you know what you know, and you are the guy who will decide where to go. Surround yourself with good people. But the yeps on the steps, they're great fun to have around, and so are many, many other people that I've found. Listen to good advice. Then he spoke great words of wisdom as he sat there on that chair. To eat these things, said my uncle, you must exercise great care. You may swallow down what's solid, but you must spit out the air. Think before you speak. My father had warned me, don't babble, don't bray, for you never can tell who might hear what you say. My father had warned me, boy, button your lip, and I guess that I should have. I made a bad slip. Tell the truth. Stop telling such outlandish tales. Stop turning minnows into whales. Respect your elders. You must not hop on pop. Focus. This was no time for play, this was no time for fun, this was no time for games, there was work to be done. Don't be afraid to accept help. I floated twelve days without toothpaste or soap. I practically almost had given up hope. When someone up high shouted, here, catch the rope, then I knew that my troubles had come to an end, and I climbed up the rope calling, thank you, my friend. Expect the unexpected. I heard a strange peep, and I took a quick look, and you know what I saw with the look that I took? A bird laid an egg on my arithmetic book. Face up to adversity. But I've bought a big bat. I'm all ready, you see. Now my troubles are going to have troubles with me. Don't obsess. This spot, it was driving me out of my mind. What a spot, what a spot for a fellow to find. My troubles were growing the way it kept going. Where would it go next? There was no way of knowing. Be careful. So I said to myself, now I'll just have to start to be twice as careful and be twice as smart. I'll watch out for trouble in front and in back sections by aiming my eyeballs in different directions. Try new things. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam, I am. You do not like them? So you say, try them, try them, and you may. Try them, and you may, I say. See the light at the end of the tunnel. Then just when I thought I could stand it no more, by chance I discovered a tiny trap door. I popped my head out. The great sky was sky blue, and I knew from the flowers I'd finally come through to the banks of the beautiful River Wahoo. Be flexible. The bus stop was there, and that part was just fine. But tacked onto a stick was a very small sign, saying notice to passengers using our line. We are sorry to say that our driver, Butch Myers, ran over four nails and has punctured all tires. So until further notice, the 442 cannot possibly take you to Salisalu. But I wish you a most pleasant journey by feet. Signed, Bus Line President Horace P. Sweet. Take chances. The places I hiked to, the roads that I rambled, to find the best eggs that have ever been scrambled. If you want to get eggs you can't buy at a store, you have to do things never thought of before. Expand your horizons. The more that you read, the more things you will know. The more that you learn, the more places you'll go. Keep your eyes on the prize. There are so many things you can learn about. But you'll miss the best things if you keep your eyes shut. Embrace the mysteries of life, because you never can tell what goes on down below. This pool might be bigger than you or I know. Brainstorm. Think, think, she cried. Her thinker-upper gave a snorty snore. It started thunk-thunk-thunking as it never had before. With all of her might, her eyes shut tight, she cried, thunk-thunk some more. Study. You can learn about ice, you can learn about mice, 
You can learn about the price of ice. You might learn a way to earn a few dollars, or how to make donuts, or kangaroo collars. Make a plan. Do you ever sit and fidget when you don't know what to do? Everybody gets the fidgets, even me and even you. Go the extra mile. So you see, there's no end to the things you might know, depending on how far beyond zebra you go. Think outside the box. And zats is the letter I use to spell zats it, whose nose is so high that most nobody pats it. So to get there and do it, I built an invention. The three-seater zats it nose padding extension. Work hard, play hard. But it's hard work being king, and he does his work well. If he wants to have a bit of fun, sure, let him have it. Be grateful. When you think things are bad, when you feel sour and blue, when you start to get mad, you should do what I do. Just tell yourself, ducky, you're really quite lucky. Some people are much more, oh ever so much more, oh muchly much much more unlucky than you. Put your best foot forward. Left foot, right foot, feet, feet, feet. How many, many feet you meet. Embrace your strengths. Shout loud. I am lucky to be what I am. Thank goodness I'm not just a clam or a ham. Or a dusty old jar of sour gooseberry jam. I am what I am. That's a great thing to be. Be proud of who you are. Of all the shapes you might have been, I say hooray for the shapes we're in. Be proactive. Unless someone like you cares a whole awful lot, nothing is going to get better. It's not. Go green. Plant a new truffula. Treat it with care. Give it clean water and feed it fresh air. Grow a forest. Protect it from axes that hack. Then the Lorax and all of his friends may come back. Check out the competition. You have to be smart and keep watching their feet, because sometimes they stand on their tiptoes and cheat. Remain humble. The rabbit felt mighty important that day, on top of the hill and the sun where he lay. He felt so important up there on that hill, that he started in bragging as animals will. Be patient. If I wait long enough, if I'm patient and cool, who knows what I'll catch in McElligot's pool. Multitask. I can hold up the cup and the milk and the cake. I can hold up these books and the fish on a rake. I can hold the toy ship and a little toy man, and look with my tail, I can hold a red fan. I can fan with the fan as I hop on the ball, but that is not all, oh no, that is not all. Learn to improvise. All I need is a reindeer, the Grinch looked around, but since reindeer are scarce, there was none to be found. Did that stop old Grinch? No, the Grinch simply said. If I can't find a reindeer, I'll make one instead. So he called his dog Max, then he took some red thread, and he tied a big horn on the top of his head. Think big. My new zoo, McGrew zoo, will make people talk. My new zoo, McGrew zoo, will make people gawk. At the strangest odd creatures that ever did walk. I'll get for my zoo a new sort of hen, who roosts in another hen's top knot, and then another one roosts in the top knot of his, and another in his, and another in his, and so forth, and upward and onward, gee whiz. Don't yell. I do not like this one so well. All he does is yell, yell, yell. I will not have this one about. When he comes in, I put him out. Treat everyone as your equal. I'm quite happy to say that the Sneetches got really quite smart on that day. The day they decided that Sneetches are Sneetches, and no kind of Sneetch is the best on the beaches. Remember the little guy. It is good I have someone to help me, he said, right here in my hat on the top of my head. It is good that I have him here with me today. He helps me a lot. This is little cat A. Pat yourself on the back. Come on, open your mouth and sound off at the sky. Shout loud at the top of your voice, I am I. Me, I am I. And I may not know why, but I know that I like it. Three cheers, I am I. Take a walk on the wild side. 
Did you ever fly a kite in bed? Did you ever walk with ten cats on your head? Did you ever milk this kind of cow? Well, we can do it. We know how. If you never did, you should. These things are fun, and fun is good. Know how to make an entrance. What an opening night! What a night! What a sight! I'll hoist up the curtains, the crowd will crowd in, and my circus McGurkus will promptly begin, with a welcoming toot on my welcoming horn, by my horn-tooting apes from the jungles of Jorn, where the very best horn-tooting apes are all born, cause the very fresh air there is fine for their lungs, and some of those fellows have two or three tongues. Be a good host. You couldn't say scat, cause that wouldn't be right. You couldn't shout scram, cause that isn't polite. A host has to put up with all kinds of pests, for a host above all must be nice to his guests. So you'd try hard to smile, and you'd try to look sweet, and you'd go right on looking for moose moss to eat. Know when to call it a night. Tomorrow will come, they'll go back to their chore, they'll start on the road, zizzer zoofing once more. But tonight they've forgotten their feet are so sore, and that's what the wonderful night time is for. Indulge. I could eat a goose moose burger, fifteen pickles and a purple plum, donuts, dumplings, blueberry bumplings, chocolate mush mush, super sweet, clam stew, ham stew, watermelon, wash wash. Oh, the things that I could eat. But don't overindulge. Silly Sammy Slick. Sipped six sodas and got sick, sick, sick. Age gracefully. You're in pretty good shape for the shape you're in. Uphold justice. I know up on top you are seeing great sights, but down at the bottom we too should have rights. Let freedom ring. And the turtles, of course, all the turtles are free, as turtles and maybe all creatures should be. Be loyal. I meant what I said, and I said what I meant, an elephant's faithful one hundred percent. Cherish diversity. We see them come, we see them go. Some are fast and some are slow. Some are high and some are low. Not one of them is like another. Don't ask us why, go ask your mother. Never underestimate the power of one. A person's a person no matter how small. Or the power of song. The chief Yukuru had sent them to meet me, along with the right-side-up song girls to greet me. They sang, O oh, be faithful, believe in thy butter, and they lifted my spirits right out of the gutter. Search for meaning. Then the Grinch thought of something he hadn't before. Maybe Christmas, he thought, doesn't come from a store. Maybe Christmas, perhaps, means a little bit more. Open your heart. And what happened then? Well, in Whoville, they say, that the Grinch's small heart grew three sizes that day. And always remember, and you will succeed, yes, you will indeed, ninety-eight and three-quarters percent guaranteed. Kid, you'll move mountains. The End